Hi, this is MC Zetti for my next episode of my Let's Play. Um, I updated the pack. Uh, at the, up to now I was manually updating my own mods, but I decided to do a global update now. I had to fix a few issues, but one good thing is uh, that Andrio and uh, painted facades, uh, the connected textures work nicely now, so that's fine. In this episode I would like to prepare, prepare for going to the end and killing the Ender Dragon. But I don't have good armor yet, so I'm a bit investigating uh, what my options are. I was also looking at the baubles. I may have to go into Botania a bit more. I also updated uh, baubles in Botania by the way, so I have more slots now. Which is good. So, gearing up, having a good uh, ranged weapon and uh, a good uh, uh, sword may be sufficient, but a go uh, good armor is uh, one of the things I'm going to work on in this episode. Let me first do some research on what options I have, and I will be back. So I was preparing for going to the end. I wanted to see what kind of options I have for uh, ranged weapons. And, uh, I decided, well, let's try the crystal bow. So this was easy. Then I looked at this portal elven trade. I have some mana diamonds already, but uh, well, it seems there is a lot to do, so I made an altar and I made the agglomeration plate and now I'm trying to see how to proceed, I've never done this before so I need to make some uh, terra steel uh, history is empty now, because I restarted so let's see Uh, searching doesn't seem to work like this, it seems. Ah, I'm in the lookup history, okay. Uh, let's do it differently then. Like this. Next page, okay, I have made that. Okay, mana steel ingot, mana diamond, and mana pearl. This mana steel ingot, mana diamond, and mana pearl. And this one now. something so just checking out how this works mana still ingot mana and um, not sure if these are linked correctly and also not sure if the mana pearl is X no oh, no it's not what I wanted to throw okay let's retry this something now <coughs> there might not be uh, and pool is completely empty let's direct these two because I redirected it I don't have sufficient mana generation of course can I see how far away this So I'm not exactly sure that I'm doing this correctly at the moment. But there are some effects going on. Uh, 
I'm going to have to read up a bit on this. So I will be I will be back. So the first items despawned unfortunately because I didn't have enough mana. I read up a bit and it appears you need about equivalent of half a pool of mana so um but it's no, not a big problem I have enough. So I made a bunch more of these uh, endo frames to speed it up a bit and I'm waiting until this is uh, half full before I put new items on there. Hopefully that will work. So uh seems ter Terra Steer is a lot more com complicated than thing than uh, the other stuff I've done so far with Botania. But it's fun to play with this and see what uh, I will be able to come up with. So, by the way, I also made some other thing, which I made a ring and I put a uh, regeneration uh, thing in it. But I'm not sure it doesn't appear to be working. Let's see if I can find a mob to damage me a bit. Um, where are, are all the mobs when you want them? Oh, there's a spider, that's good. And the creeper as well. Yeah, of course, now I'm getting regeneration because uh, my health is uh, good. Okay, so let's see. It doesn't f look like it's working differently than what than how it worked uh, uh, without that ring. So not sure exactly how I should get uh, that to work. So I'm cer certainly not getting a lot of my health back, and it says so. Buffs only work if you have one ring equipped, so I have only one ring equipped, at least that's how I understand it. And I did add a regeneration upgrade to it, which is not visible here in the tooltip. So not sure, if you know how this works, please let me know. Um, also, uh, I need to clean up my inventory first, uh, let's put a few things away. And it's not much that I can clean up really. Uh, also, I still have this bow, lava bow from Armor Plus, which is pretty good. So if uh, and this one is also not bad, but that's just vanilla bow. So if it turns out that uh, the Botania bow is not good, I can always fall back to that other bow. Are we? Okay, so we're making progress. I have to check on coal as well here. Okay, I will keep this running for a while and hopefully it will work now. So I made another setup similar to this one. So to increase the mana generation and this one is over half full so I think I'm going to try it again hopefully it will work this time so let's see ok it's bumping over the mana I'm going to try to not to let these items despawn this, this time draining quickly yes it worked very nice okay so that's one ingot not sure how many I actually need for the bow uh, uh, for the portal I mean let's uh, see elven trait oh yes it was um, Oh, 
was some kind of portal block that I needed. Elven Gateway Court, this was the thing. In Elven Gate Core. Oh, there, okay, so I, I, I am actually able to make this already. Um, I need more glittering wood. Let's see, I have some. Okay, so now I have an Elven Gateway Core. No idea how to use this. Let me put it here. So. Elven Gate Core. Nature Pylons. I think an Enderman is trying to teleport here somewhere. I'm not sure where is he yet, where he is. Okay, doesn't really matter. Okay, so I need a few more things it seems. I'm I probably also need oh there he is. Okay, that's dangerous. Um I probably also need a bit more room. Can I try? Okay. And that's loud. But he's dead at least. What did I get? Ender crystal. Quantum flux. Okay, so I will be back trying to see how I can do this. And this one's. Okay. <coughs> Let me research a bit. So. I decided to expand the platform a bit and I set up uh, a portal to Alfheim, is, I believe it's called, Elven Gateway Core. So these are now collecting mana and I decided to automate it using RF2's control instead of this hopper uh, thing. So it's basically the same principle, it's still the pressure plate, the open crates, but not a hopper. But uh, a note, and the program just goes fetch, fetches coal, which it puts in its internal slot, checks if the redstone is uh, not set, because if it's set then there is already a coal on the plate, and then it pushes either to the A side and for the B side as well. So it's a simple program, and it fetches the items from storage, and I have, thanks to the quarry, uh, a lot of coal. So this area isn't chunk loaded, but whenever I am here, it will uh, collect mana and the portal will also remain open. But I, at the moment I cannot open it yet because it's, it doesn't have enough. So I need to, to run this for a while. I'm also going to increase the number of these, so I'm going to create a few extra and the flames to speed the process up. Okay, I think it's time to try this. We are almost full. So let me see if I can open it. Okay, mana is draining. Never done this before. It seems stable now, so that's good. And let's see if I can throw something in it. I'm not sure if that's how it's supposed to work. Oh yes. I need two for the bow. Okay, nice. 
So that worked. So let me see. Uh, I also need another living wood twig. Was it that this? Let's see. And now I should be able to make the bow. Oh yes, where is my mana view string? Crystal bow. Okay. Now I need a test subject. Okay, it one shot at the sheep, but that's not. Ah, it didn't actually. Does it not consume arrows? That's interesting. Let me put those away. Does it still work then? Oh no. But I'm curi curious. Let me put one arrow there. And. It doesn't consume the arrow, that's good, so it has infinity on its own. I'm going to do a test in the nether with this. Um, so, by the way, now that I have a good uh, Botania setup, I can also see into making some other stuff for... Uh, because the goal is um, still to kill the Ender Dragon. So I'm going to try to make good stuff for that. Um, so, oh, I have the quarry is running, and I'm full of ores, and my torches are being filled. I think I need to turn off the quarry because uh, I have way too much stuff. <coughs> So let me first uh, disable that for a while. So the builder in the overworld is now disabled. Thousand emeralds, oh my god. Okay, how many diamonds do I have? I have more emeralds than diamonds, it seems. Uh, ingots are still being generated. It goes slow, but it doesn't have to go faster. Um, but about bows. I had another bow. I wonder where it went. Maybe yeah, the lava bow. And I'm also going to compare with the normal bow. for the normal bow. I will actually need uh, more arrows probably for the lava bow as well. And apparently the crystal bow doesn't use durability either. So seems a pretty good bow in that respect. I might need to expand mining. So I will... Um, okay, let me do it with you. Going to try to kill some pigmen because they are not that weak. <coughs> And I have a good place where they often spawn here. Okay, let me see. Uh, so first the normal bow. Let me pick. Okay. Okay. 
ओके शुड पिक वन द हेल सो द नॉम बहुत शुरली डजेंट वन शॉट इन दैट्स ओके लेट्स किल दिस ग्रुप सो लेट्स ट्राई द लाफ अपो Lava bow, one shots. Crystal bow. Ah, crystal bow is actually weaker. That's a bit unfortunate. It doesn't consume arrows, though. I wonder if I should get this guy. So, okay. So actually, the lava bow is still the best option. It's a consistent one shot, but I think it does use up, uh, the arrows. Okay. Let me try the lava bow again. No, it's definitely worse. What's that? I wonder what the advantages of that uh, crystal bow then. Maybe I'm not using it right. I don't know. Okay, I will be back. So, I read up a bit and found out that you actually have. A greater band of mana, and I thought maybe the bow would work better, so I charged it a bit. And uh, but it is still not one-shotting them. So okay, must admit I'm a bit disappointed in the crystal bow. Um, and now. They are all angry at me, which is fine. I can handle it. So, I'm probably going to use the lava bow then, which seems a lot better. Um, okay. Still want to look at some armor. I'm, I thought maybe. So I thought maybe uh, terra steel armor was good. But it's. Uh, let me check that out. I can make terra steel, but it's uh, a lot of work, of course. Okay. Okay, that's uh, a lot of stuff to make. So, okay, I will see what I will do about that. So, um, I'm waiting for the mana to build up uh, to make another Terra Steel thing uh, ingot. So, I want to try the Terra Steel armor. But in the meantime, I made a small enchanting area here, and I discovered I can make a power of five um, a book. But I need a bit more XP, so let me. Oh, that's the wrong button. Let's first get to level thirty-five. Perhaps a bit cheaty, but uh, if it works. Okay, 
so oops let's see power five and now I probably need some okay, channel cost five so this would probably beef up that a bit let me check it out yes vanilla mechanics um, so going to test if this is better than what we had before in the meantime let me see oh, should be enough for another terra steel so let me first make that one I need one of these uh, no, not this one and this one <coughs> so it's quickly draining this one okay so that's another one When I have three, I can make uh, the chest plate. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, time for another test. Still no one shot. Uh. Okay, so unfortunate but that's how it is so I'm back in the nether this time I'm going to test armor so I make uh, dark armor fully empowered all four items so going to test how good that is let me see hi okay about okay so that's that gives an ID and let me try to see if I replace only this one because it's a bit expensive to make all of them and see when I have full health Not sure. It seems worse, but it doesn't make a lot of difference. Knockback resistance. Let me try to find another. Are you mad at me? Okay, so that was not very good. Let me try again. I have the feeling the dark armor is slightly better. So, Botania is not ideal for this situation. It's closer to vanilla, I suppose, which is, of course, okay. In any case, um, this wraps up this episode. So, I think I'm going to go with this and the lava bow for the Ender Dragon. Um, I hope you enjoyed this episode and I would like to hear some comments about what I can do more to prepare for the Ender Dragon. So, see you next time. Bye bye.